playing like that. It's really, really good from right here. Make sure y'all like this video, subscribe, comment, turn that bell. I gotta say something to this. Oh man. How you doing? Yeah. Ain't looking amazing. I'm gonna have to talk to your car. You got a man? Yeah. I mean, I don't see that ring on your finger. <laughs> Hold on, talk to you real quick, baby. What's your name? I'm gonna talk to you real quick, baby. Ah, okay. Says you got a man. Hey. All right. Be like that. I see how long she got a man. Right now, oh, she's, damn. she's a runner, she's a track star. Oh. She running back. Hey. Yo, what's poppin', man? Welcome back to the channel, man. We about to get into this gold digger prank video with my boy Nayir. Shout out to him, man, for providing this video. If you're new to the channel, be sure to leave a like, comment, turn on post notification, man. Hey, it's been a little uh minute since I posted a video like this. If you haven't yet, go check out my other content. The description down below has the other links to my other videos. With that being said, let's get into this. Damn, she really. Say the girl that said she got a man. Really out here running. What's up? Is this your car? Yeah, why? Well, what's up? I'm trying to holler at you real quick. Holler at you for what? I just want to get to know you. Man, uh, but you got a man though, right? Ain't yeah. looking amazing. I'm about to pick up your car. You got a man? Yeah. I mean, I'm still oh, ringing your phone. Nah, it's not that serious. Not that serious. Mm How -hmm. come? Okay. We've been together for like a minute. It's a minute? What you mean a minute? It's not serious. How is not serious? Like you, but you just said you had a man though, right? Yeah, but so it gotta be serious. It's not that serious. So why you say you gotta be, it don't even matter. If you got your man, you got your man in general. I don't like to come between anything or miss my happy home, you know? So like, you say you got a man, then you got a man. I respect it. No, but it's not that serious. I can't hear you. Come, come over here on this side. You know, these females are hilarious. Now it's not that serious now. Shake my head. <laughs> what do you say? So let me talk to you real quick. I mean, talk about what though? Like, I just want to get to know you. Well, how come? Like, why not? Yeah, that's Like, I mean, it seems like you got your life together. Okay. Seems like you got your life together. Okay. You're good looking. Like, let me oh, so now I'm good looking now. Yeah. But I was good looking when I was uh, coaching you, though, right? Yo, I only wonder to myself, right? I'm chilling in the comfort of my home. These females out here, boy, they funny as fuck. They bogus as fuck, too. But. Have you ever ran into a woman like this where you know she has something going on and she just persistently just cap out on the fact that she doesn't have something going on? Like, come on. This shit is wild. They really be thinking because they got some ass on them, got somewhat of a decent face, pretty whatnot. They just supposed to get everything thrown. It's a new time, bro. It's not that way no more. Like, dudes don't think that way no more. Some dudes still simps, but... Most dudes don't think that way. We don't care for that, bro. Like, what's up here, bro? <laughs> Crazy. Well, just distracted. Distracted about what? Oh, okay, okay. So now it's like you're not on the phone now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Let me get to know you real quick. Get to know me, huh? It seemed like you wasn't really into me, though. She think he a good. That was you, though. It I didn't get, seem I like... I could try and get to know you. Try and get to know me. Mm -hmm. Okay, but you got your whole man, so how does it want to work? We can figure something out. Figure what out? We can get... To talk in and see what you're about. Okay, so me and you it's, talking, then what? It's, we're not committed. Like, it's not that serious. Mm, it's not that serious. So why would you say that, then? Why, why would you say you got your man if it's not that serious, then? Because, I mean, like... That don't make any sense. Really don't, but... I mean, you look good. <clears throat> you drive this car like this is your car? Yeah, one of my cars. Okay. Yeah, yeah really yeah, blow. Get to know you. Really got the cat with. What's your name? Alexandra. Alexandra. Okay, where are you from? I'm from Atlanta. Okay, I've only been in Houston. For a couple of years. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I just moved here from Ohio. Mm -hmm. So yeah, my first week out here, I was about my neighborhood, just trying to see the vibes, you know, get a feeling in Houston. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Right. But I seen you, you know what I'm saying? They say, watch what you like. You know, you look amazing. But like I said, you got your man. I ain't really trying to keep things on a low, though. You feel me? Mm -hmm. That's what it's like we got to do. We can we can talk about it. Mm -hmm. Talk about it, huh? Mm -hmm. We can figure something out. This is what you got to okay, do, y'all. Okay. Y'all got to understand this? that. This is the type of things that you have to do when you meet a woman like this. You have to That's make her right feel there. like, oh, yeah, she you got know a whole what I'm saying? Man. I know you got a man, but now. I don't really want to do that. Like, yeah, exactly. Crazy. Out here looking crazy. So how long you been talking? Oh, but a nigga find out. A couple weeks. Damn, so this beginning stage, you already cheating? I mean, we're not committed, so it's not, not cheating. Uh, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So where you just going to? Um, I'm actually going to the gym. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. How often do you go to the gym? 
day. Every day? If I can. So Monday to Sunday? Mm -hmm. Damn, so no days off? No days off. No rest days? No rest days. So you got no, no recovery days? You need it's recovery day. Mm, okay. How often do you going to the gym? How long? Like an hour. Hour? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. You get locked in for how long? Like two years. Two years? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Okay, you look amazing. No, you smell good too. What's that scent you got on? Um, honestly, I couldn't tell you. You don't know? <laughs> I don't know. I mix yeah. them all together. Yeah? Oh, okay. What's your ethnicity? I am Venezuelan and black. Oh, okay, okay. She can't lie about herself while we're filming. Do y'all see any black in here? Please, somebody let me know. I, don't, I mean, maybe, maybe a dad, maybe, you know, possibly. You know, but she reaching. I feel like she, uh, I don't know. It's kind of hard to say. That's all. Let me check you out. See my hand real quick. Yes, man. Okay. I like what I see. So you want to hop inside? All right, hop inside. Don't waste my time, all right? Where's my time, please? Gotta let him know. Doing me, how you gonna hop in a car like this and talk about this is nice as if you got one of these? What you talking about? This is nice, the most expensive vehicle you ever sat in. What are you talking about? So, I own this one, oh, okay? Yeah, so what I'm a business doing? owner. I like that. I do hair, yeah. you do hair? Mm -hmm. so this woman hair, just woman hair. Oh, okay, yeah, that scent is like it smells so good. I smell even more now because we like it a buck. Mm -hmm. yeah, that smells good. It's like you drowned yourself in it. I didn't actually. Then he's like, well, how many, how many spreads? It's one, two. Quick little one, two, one, two. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you do hair, right? I do. Okay. Like what type of hairstyles do you do? Everything? Um, I do, yeah, like blonding, extensions, oh. more like the luxury. Oh, yeah. okay. Mm -hmm. That's how long have you been doing that? 10 years. 10 years? Mm -hmm. Damn. Okay. So you a, you a veteran in this like, I'm a vet. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't play with you. I heard you. Uh -huh. Okay. So you got like a whole, like, you know, like people in the shop working. We everything. Yeah, it's just me and my business owner. Oh, okay. We just do hair. We own it and we do hair. Okay, so all they got to do is do hair. Mm -hmm. Nobody do lashes there? Hair? No. Why not? You do like a one top, you know what I'm saying? Oh, uh, yeah, that's like a five year plan. So mm, yeah, I feel like uh, she got some type of genuine to her, but at the same time, I don't know, man. We're going to see, bro. She ain't really pop out with no crazy questions yet. Most females in the first three minutes be asking the most outrageous questions. Let's go get something to eat. Let's go shopping. <laughs> okay, we'll see. Situation, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. So, like, what's your angle? Like, what's you, what you say something like this for? Um, definitely owning, like, a storefront, for sure. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so, like, you always, like, want to do hair or, like, yes, or just for going? Sure. Uh, and so, like, since you, like, young, mm -hmm. you've been doing that. Okay, that's what's up. I like that. So, you just do hair only? Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. you basically talking to someone right now. Yeah. But it ain't serious. Right. Mm -hmm. What about you? Like, you seen somebody? Like, no, no, if I was seeing somebody, I wouldn't be talking to you right now. You know? oh, okay. Yeah, I take like. So you're faithful. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Take that very serious. Okay. You know, that's what I'm saying. Like, how me and you gonna work out though? Because like, I can't spin this real fast. Mm -hmm. and, like, you know. I mean, it's like I said, it's not that serious. So where you gonna so, leave for me? I mean, if we can get to know each other and see, see if we work something out. Like, like yeah, what, what you wanna work out? What you mean? When you say work something out. What you mean by that? I mean, I wanna know how serious you are. I'm just saying right now, I'm just meeting you though. I'm so like, maybe, like, what, what if we like- But if we get to talking days? and then you are being serious about it, then yeah, like, it's- Hmm. So she got a boyfriend. She's a business owner. She said if things are working out. So she willing to leave her boyfriend, pretty much. She said it ain't that serious though. So if they ain't serious, I guess it's okay, right? That's okay? Y'all let me know what y'all think. We can just move on. But I don't know that you're gonna leave me like how you about to leave him though. Oh man. What made me you so special? For it. But like what made me so special though? I mean, you've got your life together. Wow. It seems like. No, okay, so you saying that he don't got his life together or something? Right. Oh you don't? Wow. So what you find a guy that like more put together more than mine. Yeah, like I'm trying to find somebody to take care of me. So I'm not about to take care of you. Yeah, oh, you're not? Why would I do that? Because look at me, like why wouldn't you want to take well, care of me? Well you like you don't get that too soon to even say something like that? To even ask. Yeah, but like I gotta lay it off on the table. Like I mean, right off the bat. But nah, 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 nah. Like that made me look at you a little different. Like that made you come back from one thing, you feel like you only focus on me just taking care of you. Like 
Yeah, I mean, why wouldn't you want to take care of me? I mean, because you're not my woman, though. Like, you feel me? Yeah, mm-hmm. but what if I am? But, you so what's, okay, me? so what you gonna do with me? I mean, whatever. Okay, so you gonna cook for me? It. Yeah, maybe. What you mean, maybe? <laughs> we can <laughs> talk about it. So clean. Maybe you can get a chef or a maid. All that I do. I can just like oversee it, you know? I, I, I want to get a chef and maid if I got you in the crib, right? Yeah, but I mean, I have a life too. I can't just be cooking and cleaning all day. So what you gonna be doing if I'm taking care of everything? What are you doing? I'm working. You work, so you save your money then? Yeah. Oh, okay, so you want me to spend, basically pay for all the bills and hire a chef and hire, how that makes sense though. Yeah, mm-hmm. I mean. So how you make my life easier? Like people who have relationships, they should make your life easier, right? Yeah, I'll be how you make for my, you. How you like, be there for me? Like doing what though? Just like affection and like, you know, we can go on date nights. You can okay, so are you paying for date nights today? No. So. Oh man, see this would be that bullshit right here. They'd be that real deal bullshit right here. I don't understand. A woman like this is dealing with a man that she says, quote, unquote, don't have his life together. But yet this man has his life together. And she rather sit here and say that she don't want to do what he asks. Whether it's pay for a date night, whether it's pay for a trip, whether it's pay for this or that. But yet the dude she possibly with, she'll end up doing that for him. So I don't get the concept of coming across somebody that has more than you, but you're not willing to do for them. But you're willing to do for somebody that has less than you. You see how this this is just all over the place? Okay, look, understand, Shorty, this. I hope your guy finds this shit out, okay? Because this shit don't make no sense. I'm sorry. What I pay for date nights? So what are you doing? Hyping my life easier, though. I'm still having to spend. Right. I'm about to just be by myself. Because you're going to have me. Like, no. I will help in any I'm other way. I'm doing all that right now, baby. Any other way. Hyping my life. There ain't no difference. Like, what I'm getting like, what I'm getting out of this is what I'm trying to understand. I mean, you're going to have me. But what are you bringing to the table, though? Like, I mean... Like I said, I can be affectionate. I can yeah, a lot of girls go can with that. you to places. I can do your hair. <laughs> Bogus. <laughs> Bogus, goofy ass. No, we don't care. We don't care about that. Listen, y'all, understand this, man. We don't care about the... Like, that, that shit ain't nothing, okay? She ain't one time say, okay, you know, I'm willing to help you out if things get hard or anything like that. She thinks that... Most guys just want to get that, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know I can't say it on YouTube. I don't want to say it on YouTube. But look, y'all know what time it is, man. I say you don't even want to hear it. Can you do dreads? I know how to. No? I can do a retwist for you. I definitely need a retwist. Let's see? I'm like too much saying right now I don't want to open no cut and no retwist. I can do a cut for you. Nah, you ain't about to mess my head up, though. <laughs> but I like how you like, you know what I'm saying? You willing to try, but yeah. not nah, like... A man, like, if you pay all the bills, like, one thing I definitely want, like, my career to be, like, you know, say clean or come home to home cook meal. Like, ain't nothing like right. a woman cooking, you know? Right. So, well, like, you that's... cook every now and then, you know, like, a couple times a week. A couple times a week. Mm-hmm. Yo, this is crazy. See, this is, this is the, this is that thin line. This is where it, it, it gets sliced. How the fuck do you expect, I gotta say it, I'm sorry, this is where I gotta go in. How the fuck do you expect a man to want to take care of you and do all these things for you, but you're not even willing to do the things that he asking you to do? And then you want to sit here and say a couple of times, you want to put a limited amount on what the hell you going to do for him, but you expect him to do everything for you. This is why I don't understand. This is this is why most men do what the fuck they do. They go out and they cheat. They do it because women like her, they sit here and they ask for these things. And then when they put a fucking limit on it and act like it's a, it's a goddamn bubble of, oh, this is how much I'm going to do for him. No, no. This man has much more than the man you say you with. This man has much more than you. And you talking about you going to cook a couple times. If this man wants seven meals for seven days, you should cook them seven meals for them seven goddamn days. You crazy. So when we go out, then we go on like 50 feet on the bill? No. Oh, God. So you want me to do all that as well? Yeah. So let's say um, take care of it, right? That's how I'm doing everything you do, right? Fuck take care of the bills. You're doing you. You doing your, you know what I'm saying? Still doing your business. You save up your money because it's like bogus. You ain't spending money on nothing, right? Mm-hmm. Right. You take care of everything, right? So let's say, uh, you know, I'm having a bad month. You know, and I can't pay the bill. Can we get a note on the door saying, boom, you know, the bill got to be due by this time. Mm-hmm. And he's like, yo, I need you to go ahead and phone. Would you help me with the bill? I can't do that. Mm. But can't you? I just. So you'd rather be outside and get put out? If you can't pay for the bills, that's a problem. I mean, 
I'm in a life though. It does, yeah. but that's we a team, right? So when I'm down, you help me. When you yeah, down, help you but up, right? That shouldn't fall on me. It should fall on you, but 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 listen, that's what relationships are about. Like we help each other out, right? Right. And yeah. I think you help. You. So what he pretty much saying is, you do not need to be in no damn relationship. You need to just be single, because obviously, you're not willing to do that yourself out because you have to be outside then. I mean, she she if it comes to that, that, I've got places to crash. You know, oh, you got places yeah. to crash. Mm, so, we're like, where I'm gonna go then? I don't know. I mean, you yeah. got to come with, don't you? Wow, that's uh, that. Uh, yeah, that says a lot about you. Yeah, I don't really like your mentality. I don't like, like the I mean, I'm just saying. I mean, yeah, you just saying, but that is something I'm not like really into. Like, it's, you're telling me right now who you, are, who you are as a person. So, I'd be a fool to keep continuing this conversation with you, or then I'm gonna take you serious. Yeah. You're telling me right now who you are. You give like a go to the vibe though. I mean, I mean I'm already rocking gold. No, I'm good. You have a nice day. Yeah, you get your ass out. What do you mean you have a nice day? You have a nice day. I'm good. Get the fuck out. Yeah. What do you mean? What's like, look, I mean? At, what what look at me. Why do you want to take care of me? Oh, what the fuck? Take care no. of me. You just give out pretty bum vibe. I'm pretty oh, bum yeah. walking pretty down bum the street. Is pretty bum is your ass. Get your ass yeah. out, man. Yeah, cool. Why are you selling up there? Yeah, get your ass out, man. Keep your car. Why? No, no, no. Yeah. Yeah. Bogus ass. ass, bogus ass, gold dusty ass, ass. gold diggers. Yo, yeah, I'm gonna wrap this shit up and say this, man. We don't deal with the gold diggers. We don't deal with the type of woman that sit there and say that she wants a man to do all these type of things, but not even willing to bend to his will. With that being said, man, shout out to Nair for providing this video. Leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what y'all think about this shorty, because obviously she's a gold digger at finest, and I believe that with my heart. Shout out to y'all, man. I'll see y'all. How he getting all these racks? How he getting all that cash? That's the question that they ask. But I'm spazzing on their ass in my phone. I'm going fast. Fuck your questions. I'm a boss. I used to take hella losses. Now broke niggas, keep your distance. I ain't got.